Merwim Quithis. Hey guys, Rorius here. Welcome to Pandora's Christmas Surprise. This is the next episode in Rorius's... Rorius's Assorted Christmas. <laughs> Pandora's Christmas Surprise. Yeah, this is a little indie game that I found on itch.io. Uh, I was looking for like Christmassy stuff. And this was the only game that I, that I saw that looked interesting to me. Wait, did I skip the cutscene by accident? I hope I didn't. Um, <laughs> okay, I thought I'd just check to make sure I uh, didn't skip the cutscene. No, okay. So the premise of the story is we are Pandora. We're a little girl who goes to open her Christmas present a day early. But when she does, it, it turns out that one of the presents that she opens was disguising itself as a Christmas present, but was actually the fabled Pandora's box. And um, it lets out those bad things. Here are your hearts and your health. Your house health. This is how damaged the house is. Don't forget to fix things. If there's still damaged furniture or enemies left, when the timer reaches zero, your parents wake up and you lose. Press space to attack or throw an item. Press E to pick up, a, up an item. E to pick up space to attack. Hold shift to repair broken furniture. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna go like... Oopsies. Oh, ouchies. Oochies. Oh. Okay, pick up item. Throw it. <laughs> also attack with football. I think it's a football. Uh, shift. <laughs> nope. Okay. Need to pick up things. Pick up more things. There's no more things. Oh, I killed it. Okay, repair. Okay, that's repaired. Uh, I don't think there's anything else damaged. Okay. Oh! I didn't realize it was multiple rooms! Okay. Oh, I got hit the second time. No! <laughs> How do you get health back? I'm so screwed! Can I pick up the fruit bowl? No. Oh, scary. Yes, okay. Repair this. Okay. I think it's everything. There's nothing else damaged in here, is there? Oh, I picked up the trophy. I think you can only pick up one thing at a time. Oh! No, no, no. No, no. Oh, okay. I can go down here. Thank God. Oh. I'm like this. I'm so close to death. One more hit and I'm dead. I don't know if it's worth picking stuff up to throw it. I don't know if it's... It probably does the same amount of damage. Okay. Probably does the same amount of damage as hitting. Yay, you won! <laughs> Congrats, you managed to get... Managed to stuff everything back into box... Into the box. And clear up. Your parents will be none the wiser. Alright, cool. Yeah. So yeah, the idea is that you just like... You pick up items. I think you can only pick up one thing at a time, yeah. And then, um, you attack. But you don't really need to pick up things. The picking up stuff is unnecessary. Um... It's more about when you hit them, they slow down. So if you just like can corner them in a good spot, you can just keep wailing on them. Um, I'll leave the TV damaged. I'll see what that looks like. See if I can do it without getting hit. <laughs> Oopsies. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Nothing even got damaged in that room. Okay, this this level's always scary. You start in one spot and then all the enemies converge on you and all in that one spot. Oh god, I got hurt! Nah! <laughs> oh, and you're invincible for a few seconds. Oh, what the heck? I wasn't even touching them. Okay, I died. God dang it. <laughs> no! <laughs> the heck? Sometimes they come in real fast, and sometimes they don't come in at all. They, they're super slow sometimes. 
None of the stairs are damaged. Oh my god, I've been hit twice already. What the heck? The hitbox is not good. <laughs> but it's otherwise pretty good. I'm just curious. I want to leave everything damaged and come back at... Oh, having one health for the rest of the level. A bit rough. Feels like something's crawling on my leg. That's pleasant. That's a pleasant feeling. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? It, it thought the level was done, but it wasn't. <laughs> what the heck? The game was like, oh, you've killed the last thing. I had not. Oh my god. What is with their movement? <laughs> Sometimes they're like really slow and other times... Like I get the idea that they, they move faster the more they can move in one direction. Oh. But then sometimes I just like lunge forward. Very frustratingly. <laughs> Hitting them is a surefire way to like slow them down, but not always. Like, there are a few times now where I've hit them. Oh my god. I've hit them and then they've just immediately kept moving afterwards. God dang, how did I do it so well the first time? I mean, I did use long ranged attacks, but the long ranged attacks didn't seem to do much. <laughs> and I damaged, the, I damaged more stuff this time. I don't know how the damage works exactly, but the, uh, the hitboxes are a little weird in this game. It is an indie game, so you can't give them too much, you know, can't get too mad at them. But um, I, I, they have the issue where it's like, They've made it so the um, the hitbox is very much like a square. My character is very much a, a rectangle, you know, not a square. There's like a there's a spot, like like this this chair is like the, my hitbox if it was like moved over. So like my head, if something's coming down towards me from up above, they can like fully clip over me and not hurt me. But if they're coming from below, they don't even touch me and they hurt me. So um, it's a little bit confusing like where you're da in danger and then the horizontal is even more confusing because it's like yeah that's like <laughs> I don't know it's, it's just hard <laughs> it's just hard to determine I swear these slimes are doing the reverse of what they normally do moving faster when I hit them there we go now I have to go around and clean up the house, so let's let's do all the cleaning at the very end. That's not easy. Oh, uh, I only had to I only had to fix the things in the one room. Uh, okay, <laughs> it's, it's a bit glitchy too. Well, that was Pandora's Christmas surprise. I wanted to do something. I wanted this assortment week, by the way. In case you're confused as to what's going on with the assorted week, even though we're already over halfway through it, <laughs> the idea was. The first thing that I'm playing is something reminiscent of something that I've played before, but is brand new. So it's like I've played it before, but it's brand new. <laughs> Actually, no, by the time the episode comes out, I will have played it before on the channel, and it'll be brand new. So something I've played before, but it's brand new. Link is something, the Link Faces of Evil is something old that I've never played. This is something new that I've never played. Tomorrow... <laughs> Can you figure out what tomorrow is? It's going to be something old that I've played before. I hope you guys look forward to the next episode of Royce's, Assort Royce's Assorted Christmas. Uh, but in the meantime, if you like what you saw, hit like. If you want to see more from me, then subscribe! I hope you guys are having a good Christmas so far, or, you know, are having a good time no matter what you celebrate, whether you celebrate something or not. Uh, whatever the case, thank you so much for watching, and until next time.